there my lovelies, this is Jenna here. Welcome to my kitchen. So today, uh, another recipe that it, uh, it's focused on breakfast. <laughs> because I love breakfast. It's the most important meal of the day, as they say. But uh, this one is different because it's a sausage, but it's a whole food plant-based one. Very wholesome, very um, nutritious, very good for your body instead of those um, things <laughs> that we buy at the supermarket. Although they're delicious, they're not so good for your body and uh, for sure not so good for your waistline. So for this reason, I'm gonna show you a delicious one, well-spiced Italian vegan uh, breakfast sausage. Let me show you how I put it together. So first we're going to start by toasting some spices. It's very important to toast the spices. Uh, it makes a whole lot of difference uh, because this way you liberate the oils and then the aromas and you will improve the taste by a mile. A mile. A million, <laughs> all right? So just in a dry skillet, a small skillet, add the spices in medium low heat and move them around like so until they are fragrant. Turn off the heat and now we're going to mash them. You can either blend them or use a, a mortar and pestle like I'm doing. And set aside. Now in a bowl we're going to add cooked red beans, some oatmeal, ground flaxseed, almond flour or oatmeal flour, nutritional yeast and spices, lots of spices. Now I have here smoked paprika, salt, black pepper, red pepper flakes, dried oregano, dried marjoram, garlic powder and smoked powder. Now add the toasted spices, stir to combine. Now it wouldn't be me if I haven't forgotten something, right? So I forgot to add oil, so add a little bit of olive oil if you want to skip it. Okay, but olive oil will uh, improve all the flavors. Again, if you want to skip it, you can, that's fine. But the olive oil will add a richness and a more taste to the food. Now mix it all together, cover it, and put it in a fridge for at least one hour. Then after one hour, you can, you can leave it overnight as well, okay? It doesn't really matter, it's all right. Uh, but it's important that they stay in, uh, in the fridge for at least one hour because we are working with the oats, okay? And the oats uh, and the flaxseed, they need time to absorb all, this, all the liquids, okay? So you don't end up with uh, something that it's difficult to uh, turn into a sausage, either an elongated one or uh, the, the round shape, the one that we're gonna make today, okay? So this is important. And after this one hour in the fridge, we're going to shape them. And then you can choose if you uh, want to either air fry them or bake them or um, shallow fry them, like pan fry them with a little bit of oil and butter. And that's what I'm gonna do. But just because, just because they happen to look better this way in the video, in a, in a, in a picture, okay? But uh, I always, always uh, air fry them. I'm addicted to my air fryer, I love it. It took me a while to get used to it, uh, to get a hand of it. But now that I do, boy, I love it. So I highly recommend, okay? So you pan fry them and then voila, it's ready. If you want to freeze them, okay? When you shape them, you just put them in a the, in the tray, okay? Cover it with a... Uh, plastic film put it in the fridge once they're frozen you remove from the tray and put them in the bag because then this way they're not gonna stick together anymore right and they are good for in the fridge for at least three months easy peasy isn't it
guys I know you some of you thought that all those spices oh my god why because the spices elevate this food to an unbelievable level the difference between um, a simple like an edible food and um, an amazing one lays in details like I said in the previous videos so if you pay attention to details and this is this is actually not a detail this is a, an important <laughs> an important part of the recipe but I know that if you feel tempted to skip the spices don't okay and toast them you can toast them and put them in a, in a little container and use it later I do that all the time all right so this is it for today I hope you love it like I do this for me is a ah I I, I love beans so we Brazilians and South Americans we are uh, deeply <laughs> involved with beans we may, we eat beans in all different ways but in this this way it was the first time and I loved it so this is it for today full recipe in the description box below and on my website if you make if you make it tag it tag me on Instagram and Facebook I love when you do that and uh, add your twist to it and let me know okay I also would love to know and uh, like this video, share, subscribe, and uh, check if you're already subscribed. If you, if you <laughs> check if you're still subscribed, if you are already subscribed, okay? And I will see you next time. Have a wonderful week. Bye bye.